Welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. What's up, guys? How is everybody doing? How have you guys been? I just been like freaking ages since I've been here. Bad. I deeply apologize for the break in transmission, but a lot has been happening. Life has been happening, guys, and I mustn't even lie to you about that. A lot has been pretty much happening and you know I told you guys that I was that I'm currently starving here in Nigeria and a lot of other things I've been busy with you know trying to find passion trying to look for more content to create trying to make trying to spice things on basically but I'm back I'm back for good you know so help me God amen 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 a lot of changes happened to me, so it's going to affect this YouTube channel, guys. This YouTube channel, like, always on my mind. I'm always looking for content to create, something to always drop on here, like, every time. But you know, we're in Nigeria, technical issues come up, power supply is very bad. As I use my iPhone to shoot my video, so it's always basically very hard sometimes. But I'm gonna be trying my best. Okay? If you guys noticed, I changed my intro because I feel like the other intro was a bit boring. I mean, like I said earlier that a lot of change is going to be happening here and it's going to be starting from my intro. So I basically just spiced up the intro. I don't know if you guys like this compared to the other one, but let me know what you feel about this intro in the comment section below. And I also changed the banner. I feel I feel like the banner needs to be spiced up, you know. I, I don't know if I did a good job with that, but let me know what you think also about the banner and about the channel we're gonna be changing a lot of stuff on the channel initially the channel was supposed to be about lifestyle self growth and random thoughts but your girl got inspired like jesus touched my soul like i got inspired <laughs> I felt like I should go more deeper in content that I'll be able to create some more content that more about me, my life, basically what I do like most times every day because I find it comfortable to do to create content in my own space within what I can do. So we're gonna be doing short hair tutorials because girl loves short cut like look cut is the new vibe guys you know so tutorials how i stand my hair on a daily basis how i get to experiment with my hair and everything so i'm going to take you guys on that we're going to be talking about self-growth like we need to talk about self-growth so we're still going to be talking about self-growth and ads and we're going to be doing more of lifestyle i want to start making vlogs dropping vlogs here and i hope i start doing that like immediately so that's pretty much the change that's happened here i just felt to let you guys know so you guys will be in the dark when the change happened all right guys i'm still going to do a video of my short hair journey with you guys this is just i'm just trying to like summarize okay. you're welcome to my channel my name is regina and you're welcome to meet regina if you haven't subscribed please hit the subscribe button show some love subscribe i mean it's free it doesn't cost a dime so just click on the subscribe button in this video i will be showing you guys something new something interesting because this is the first time i'm ever going to be trying this so i feel like to take you guys through the entire process of doing this I have a party this weekend and i feel like what was i going to do with my hair and i got to the market and i saw this crochet and they are so so lovely so guys i've been stunning crochet on this short hair i have one series of youtube videos and i've seen how they did it so i'm i just want to show you guys what i have learned and how i'm going to basically do my own guys these are the crochet braids that i got passion twist or bouncy twist that i got from my local market so i'm using three packs one pack contains 18 loops each so i'm going to be using three packs actually 
it comes with this crochet pin I'm also going to be using this rubber band I also got a few of hair accessories to have to match the shape I just washed my hair basically I've been because I relaxed my hair about three weeks ago if you haven't watched my video on how I relax my hair using mega growth and many other products you can watch it I'm gonna put the link in the description box below for you guys to it's freshly washed guys I just washed it so. so I'm gonna start with using Arami Essentials Ivory Butter I am so obsessed with Arami Essentials like the she butter smells so nice and I love it I'm going to add this to my hair to add moisture to it to make the air very 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 soft guys so I am gonna comb it out comb it out to remove all the naps in between the tangle all the cords and make the hair look super dark you know what I mean? I can't remember what I was saying at this part, but I know I was trying to pass on information across but yeah, forget, 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 forget that part. So, comb it out here, comb it in here out to remove everything possible, detangle everything. And I'm going to use a small comb, so just like tiny nap in the front, in my baby hair join everything to get that like a back hair and I'm gonna use this wax to just use this an alternative for my edge control if you don't have an edge control or you have an edge control you can use this instead I'm just trying to make you to lay the hair and make the demarcation more prominent so you guys can see it make the hair soft and it increases the length of the hair also actually I had that wax when I was on dreads but ever since I got in my dreads my them just put there and I had to put it into you right now so that's it but if you have an edge control whatever edge control you can use on it so I had to go off camera to make this this is so neat and I'm proud of myself girl you did this oh my god oh my god so I'm gonna show you guys it's very simple to make this puff it's very simple it's by far the most simplest part of it just make your puff use the wax or your edge control make a demarcation around it roll you around the hair twist your hair have the rubber band Continue putting the rubber band until it's secure enough. Don't, as you guys can see, I don't make this hair too hard to the fact that it's going to pull off my scalp or something. Oops, here at this point, I was trying to show you guys how to install the crochet, but it was quite blurry. I had to go off camera to do the remaining pops because my phone battery was dead. And this is what we have, guys. I even had, I've had it some of the crochet. Oh. Girl was bored and it had to buy. I'm sorry, guys. So, this is the crochet needle and the loop. Just trying to show you guys how to have the crochet here. It's very, very simple to have the crochet in it. And I'm gonna do all those rubber bands later, guys. All you have to do is take your crochet pin through the hair, pull the, pull the loop through the, through the hook, and bring it out. And that's it. Wrap it around the hair at a length of the hair 20 inches. As you guys can see, that's the hook. Take it through the hair like that. Pull the loop, close the lash, bring it out, take the tail of the hair through the loop, wrap it around the twist, and boom, we got it. So, guys, at this point, the next morning, I realized that the rubber bands we are not dipping into some parts so i'm basically just going to advise you that if you don't do this break the parts that you are going to breathe first then you can have the rubber band to other part because these parts give me stress after i had to do everything the previous night i had to lose it because the rubber bands wet off and i was back to breathing it you guys can see i wasn't smiling because i was tired i had to loosen out the crochet and do them again that's just it so I'm just gonna advise you breathe the part that you can breathe first 
and have the rubber band later. So same process of adding the crochets to it. Very simple. And that's it. That's it guys. So this is what we have after I had edit. And girl, they look good. Damn good. You know, so, so good. So guys, this is the finished look of the crochet. I had to do most of them off camera because my battery was low and I shoot in my iPhone 7 so I had to do most of it off camera and as you guys can see I added my accessory off camera as well there were parts that the rubber band couldn't grab onto so I had to just braid them I think somewhere around this part I had to braid them and there were other parts that the rubber band couldn't grab onto and couldn't and um and I was unable to breathe as well. So these are those parts and somewhere at the back. So I'm basically just going to use it. In between is my baby hairs and this is the skin my hair is the by the way guys. I love right now I'm gonna try to style the edges. I'm not perfect at styling my edges but I learned pretty quick through watching series of YouTube videos so I think I did a good job with the edges here and I used my petal styling gel white gel the extra super firm hood styling gel guys you can also use an edge control for this part but I don't know I I just used my styling gel because I don't have an edge control actually so just style the hair and this were the parts that the rubber band couldn't grab onto there so i just had to lay them down under the hair and it wasn't showing and we were good guys we were really good 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 ah! i love this look i love how i look girl you look so good you look so fine oh my god you blow my mind so i'm just gonna try to style show you different styles at which i look cute yeah, if you want me guys to show you different hairstyles that you can use to style your crochet braids, let me know in the comment section below. But I think I killed this look. Oh, I must mesmerize by myself. I think I look cute. This look, guys. I think I did a good job with it. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumb up. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Music at Hit Niger.